toasty one out there to say the least, Chris. To say the least, Mac, on our way into the triple digits for many areas. I want to start with our mousetrap camera. We have some showers and storms trying to develop. Something we'll probably see today with storms. Can you kind of see the base of this cloud right in here? Let's kind of focus on this area right there. Uh, some Virga showing up out there. That means it's raining out of the cloud, but it's evaporating as it falls into the drier air below. That is the setup for microbursts. So we are expecting uh, some of these storms today to have pretty localized gusty wind. So keep that in mind if you're out recreating a heat advisory today. We're going to look at that graphically here in just a moment. Denver's record is 99 set on this date last year. Uh, we are expecting 101 still here. So good chance we're going to break this record here uh, before the clouds settle in later on. 96 at the airport, 97 downtown. We were 98 bouncing around just a little bit, but still very, very warm. Warm. Here's your heat advisory. All of the highlighted counties, the entire I-76 corridor in Colorado, Denver north to Fort Collins, and then out here to the Lyman vicinity. Widespread uh, temps today, 100 to 105. 97 downtown. It is 99 in Broomfield, 96 in Wiggins. It is 97 in Boulder. Our weather watcher just outside of Boulder. Uh, she is sitting at 89 up into the foothills. Very warm there. You see all the forecasted highs here. Triple digits out onto the eastern plains. West side of town, upper 90s to around 100 degrees. And some of our northeastern locations and in the Arkansas River Valley, 105 to 107 potentially today. Widespread 80s in the high country, 90s and 100s out west. It's hot wall to wall across the state. Now, look at this. There's that storm I was showing you from the camera here down in Jefferson County. We're starting to see some showers and thunderstorms pop up and that will continue as we roll into your afternoon. This is four o'clock. Uh, I think this will be more wind than rain. If you do get a shower passing where you live, the rain will probably be fairly localized and short lived. Uh, but nonetheless, there is that chance and this will certainly feel good as the clouds build and these storms pull to the east, hopefully offering a little bit of relief from this very, very hot day. Uh, again, likely to set a record in Denver. We continue with the heat advisory going for a high of 101. The record is 99. Tomorrow still quite hot, 97. Wednesday down to 91, but then those temps start to climb Friday into Saturday. Michaelia, Saturday and Sunday, 90s. And then early next week, it looks like we may fall into the upper 80s with another plume of monsoon moisture. And that would mean our storm chances go up a little bit. So uh, something to look forward to as we have a couple of very, very hot days ahead of us. Drink your water, wear your lightweight, loose fitted clothing, wear your sunscreen, and please protect pets and people that might be in places without AC. Yes, it can definitely burn those little paws out there of the pets. All right, Chris, thank you. If you're already 